The overall goal of this procedure is to produce nanoparticle colloids with control over their size and composition for the purpose of assessing their antibacterial properties. This method can help answer key questions in the development of antimicrobial nanoparticles, including the impact of particular nanoparticle characteristics such as size, shape, and composition on toxicity. The main advantage of this technique is the production of nanoparticles from various material systems with ease, which is done in the absence of potentially hazardous chemical byproducts. Demonstrating this experiment will be Matthew Ratty, an undergraduate, and Julianne Grippenberg, a faculty member at Rutgers Camden. Assemble the ablation apparatus by placing a magnetic stir bar and a porous ablation stage inside a 50 milliliter glass beaker. Place the beaker on a magnetic stir plate and set the stir plate upon an XY translation stage to enable movement of the target during ablation. Set the ND YAG laser to operate at the fundamental wavelength of 1064 nanometers with a pulse duration of 5 nanoseconds and a pulse repetition rate of 10 Hz. Measure the energy per pulse with a laser power and energy meter. Focus the beam beneath the target on the ablation stage using a 250 mm focal length converging lens. For the synthesis of silver nanoparticles, first weigh a flat silver target using a microbalance to obtain the pre-ablation mass. Then, adhere the silver target to the porous stage using double-sided carbon tape. Add 40 milliliters of ablation liquid to the beaker. The liquid height above the target is 11 millimeters. Determine the spot size.